After nearly 20 years of construction, the world's longest rail tunnel has opened in Switzerland. European leaders, including German Chancellor Angela Merkel and French President François Hollande, attended the opening celebrations on Wednesday. The 35-mile Gothard base tunnel is a high-speed rail link under the Swiss Alps. It will eventually help slash travel time between Zurich and Milan. The tunnel will shuttle twice the roughly 9,000 people traveling between northern and southern Europe by 2020, experts say. The amount of freight transported along the route is also expected to increase, from 160 daily trains to 260. Credit Suisse estimates the new tunnel cost $12.3 billion to complete. It was funded by Swiss taxes and duties, but its construction relied on workers from a mix of other countries, including Italy and Germany. Those countries actually accounted for the bulk of the funding for the original Gothard rail tunnel, which opened in the 19th century and cost the equivalent of about 1.5 billion francs in today's currency, Credit Suisse says. Today, the Gothard based tunnel promises to more closely bind Europe, at a time when much of the public discourse has turned to tightening border controls and division.